It's the Joe Show with me, Joe. Today I'm gonna to show you how to sign up for the Chinese shopping app Taobao and what it's like shopping from home in China. Let's do it. It's the Joe Show. So you may have heard that the Chinese have a very special way of doing at-home shopping on an app called Taobao. I'm gonna show us how to sign up for Taobao and hopefully we'll get a little taste of what it could be like on Singles Day, which is the most popular shopping day in China. Let's check out Taobao, see how we sign up and see what we can find. Here we are on my Android phone. I've already downloaded the Taobao app. You can see it here, it looks like this. I'm gonna click on it to open it. We're gonna have to use a weird way of doing this. My iPhone is gonna translate the Chinese because I do not speak Chinese. So when we open it up, it looks like this. Most of these products I believe are coming from Alibaba or AliExpress. Uh, we can see some of the translations going on and there's actually a Taobao live broadcast which we will get into here. So let's click on the live broadcast and see what happens. It brings us to this page and over here we have uh, a two live broadcasts that we can view here for pants and some sort of food. So if I click on the food one, let's see what happens. That's when we have to log in. If I pause and unpause the translation, we can see what it actually looks like. It's a red button. So let's click the red button to log in. Then it says, dear, welcome. What is your mobile phone number? Now I don't have a Chinese phone, so let's see if I can actually register here. Once you enter your mobile phone number, you can obviously click the orange button to proceed. And of course you're sent a registration code like normal. We'll enter it in. And once you finish entering your verification code, you're taken to this screen, which is your Taobao account. So now I have a Taobao account. Back on the home screen, now we can possibly enter one of these live broadcasts. Ooh, it changed a little bit. Let's see if there's other ones here. Nope, nope, but there's 892 people watching. Let's see what's going on here. So here we are inside of the Taobao live stream. This is an actual live broadcast right now, selling that purse that we clicked on. Uh, I can also click here on the screen and I believe swipe up and then it takes me down to oh no this takes me to another live broadcast so now we're looking at bows for hair and I think if I swipe down I can go back to that other one for the bag yep and these are also live questions that people are asking uh, they can ask them to open up the purse they can ask them to do whatever and these two hosts here will actually do whatever the commenters are asking for it's pretty incredible um, let's see what we got here. Free shipping insurance. Yeah, they're asking about insurance. I can also like this product down here in the corner. Uh, and then if I double tap, is that, oh, then I gave it a like. Uh, and there is actually some way to buy this object, but I'm not quite sure what it is. Maybe this button down here. There's 203 left. It opens up another thing again. Yeah, and then here, I believe I can click buy immediately. You go 768. Chinese yen and then I can add the shopping cart or add a coupon so if I add it to shopping cart then I believe it'll be right in my shopping cart well, that's it added to shopping cart probably if I go back then yeah we can keep swiping through here to find all sorts of different products that are currently being sold live these are live people selling these objects. It's pretty crazy. Look at this guy selling a rock. A rock that says 310 on it. Is this a pet rock right now? Am I gonna buy this and have to take care of it? Am I gonna give it food? Is that what's going on? Like, look at this, this is craziness. We got another one. And then you can just, it's like TikTok. You can just swipe for hours. And this is how Asian people are used to doing things and why TikTok kind of feels so Asian. These two are selling jackets here. This is just endless. You can keep swiping. This is crazy. So if you're of a certain age from the United States of America or maybe even Germany where I'm currently living, you may have had made for TV or as seen on TV products where you could go on the home shopping network. Oh, we're back to the purse ladies where you could go onto the home shopping network and you could buy stuff from home. Nowadays, it's related to grannies or old people, or maybe even stay at home moms. But this is how a lot of people choose to shop in China. They see this, these are live streams and they buy their products and they actually ask the people showing the products 
to do to show them and this is very similar to what would happen at like a trade fair if you go to a trade fair this is the type of stuff that you're going to see except it'll be live and in person doing cutting demonstrations showing you the the purse i'm getting coupons now like this is this is a pretty modern and future forward way of shopping and it has not yet taken off in the west at all there's no app that i can think of like this in the western hemisphere where you can shop and do live almost at home shopping on your phone but you don't even have to be at home for this you can just be anywhere this is live anywhere shopping to interact with these people like products and add them to your shopping carts if you want to check it out and you want to shop like this uh get some chinese products because you can get it shipped to you wherever you're at so if you want to check out taobao this is what the app looks like mobile taobao you can sign up for it. you can follow the steps here to actually sign up for it now that you have a tutorial in english Check it out. It's called Taobao. I think this way of shopping is very interesting and has yet to take off in the West. If you're an entrepreneur and you're looking for an idea, I think this is a great idea to get people shopping. And it's already been validated as somewhat interesting by the Chinese and Asian market as this thing is doing gangbusters. And if you do feel like doing it, reach out to me, hijoshow at gmail.com. I'd love to collaborate with you on it. That's been today's Technology Tuesday. If you like my show, hit that subscribe button and mash that bell to get a notification every time I upload a new video. Tuesdays are for technology and check out some of my other content. But until we meet again, text something good because you know it, I love you.